a 502 right now. There will be more school resource officers in St. Charles County schools when thousands of kids return to class next Monday. And the goal is to better protect students, teachers, and staff in case of emergencies like an active shooter. Fox 2's Chris Renier live in O'Fallon, Missouri with how the increase in SROs is being paid for. Chris. Tiger Warren, you, Blair Warren, you as well. St. Charles County Council members approved the plan using $2.2 million in American Rescue Plan Act or ARPA funds. Those increased SROs will come from here at the St. Charles County Police Department. Currently, only nine of the 23 schools in St. Charles County have SROs, but under this new plan, 14 more school resource officers will be added. That means every school in unincorporated St. Charles County, Dardine Prairie, Weldon Spring, and Augusta Elementary School in the Washington School District will have a SRO on campus. That includes elementary schools, which previously did not have SROs. The funding will provide everything from hiring the SROs to giving them the equipment that they need to making sure that they have critical training so they can effectively respond to situations, including active shooters. The Francis Howell School District Superintendent praises the SRO, saying they know the schools in that district and the campus safety plans. We spoke with the St. Charles County Police Chief and a parent about adding more SROs. No one had someone around who could be there on site if something were to happen. It would be, it's, it's reassuring to know that. It's about the public safety, the safety of our kids, and after the recent events we've seen in the last several months, uh, I don't know how you can argue against this. The $2.2 million for this program is part of the $78 million in ARPA funds received by St. Charles County. We're told those additional SROs will be there when classes begin next week. For now, live in O'Fallon, Chris Renier, Fox News.